day for the Salt City and Syracuse's Hancock International Airport. Good evening, everyone. I'm Christy Casciano. I'm Jeff Kulikowski. Thanks for joining us. It is a story we at News Channel 9 were first to bring you today. After years and years of hard work by so many Southwest Airlines, it's finally coming to town. We have team coverage tonight, right? Yeah, we're going to start seeing these planes in mm -hmm. town. Kellyanne Marshall is in the studio. She's going to explain more about what this announcement means for businesses and tourism. But first, we want to go live to Madison Moore. She's at Syracuse's Hancock Airport tonight for us. Madison, so what can travelers expect with this new Southwest Airlines announcement? Well, Christy and Jeff, this is great news for Central New York travelers. This new service is going to bring three daily flights from Syracuse to Baltimore, and it's also going to bring some select flights from Syracuse to Orlando during those busier holiday months. And this service will start on November 14th, but you can start booking your tickets today. And Congressman Katko said during the press conference today, this isn't just good for people looking to travel to other destinations, but it's a huge boost for the local economy. A good airport and a, a lot of quality airline options uh, really is a huge magnet for businesses and for tourism, right? And I just what I was saying to them earlier, if you draw a circle around Central New York, Syracuse area, a couple hour circle, you have millions of people. And if we can have convenient flights and good flights, they're gonna come out of here and they're gonna spend money here and it's all gonna it's all gonna be good for Central New York. And this deal has been in the works since 2019, but it was delayed due to the pandemic. And the airport tells us that they expect this service to grow with time. Live at the Syracuse Airport, Madison Moore, News Channel 9. 